What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are at Golf Galaxy, specifically a performance center that they opened up here in my local town. This place is incredible because they have these awesome Trackman golf simulators. This is a brand new location and this place is absolutely enormous. I love this place and luckily for us, it is not too busy tonight. Um, but the reason we're here tonight is to find out if golf simulators, specifically Trackman simulators, are accurate. So you guys know in my last video, I did a what's in the golf bag and I showed you guys that I've got a book, a uh, yardage book that tells me how far I hit each club. So we're gonna put this thing to the test, hit some uh, drives and see if we can play a couple holes and see how accurate these TrackMan simulators are. Once again, huge thank you to Golf Galaxy. Look at this place, guys. Again, super sick. If you guys have a performance center around you guys, I highly suggest checking it out and getting in some uh, rounds on these awesome TrackMan simulators. Let's get started. All right, so what's cool about these TrackMan simulators is you can actually um, swipe through the clubs. So right now we've got the seven iron on the screen. I've got my seven iron in hand and uh, we're on the driving range. So let's hit a couple balls and see how this thing reacts. Again, we are testing to see how accurate these TrackMan simulators are. Let's give this thing a whack. Looking a little right, carry is 147, ball speed is 110. So we're gonna get warmed up with a couple shots and then I'm gonna take out the uh, yardage book that I've got and compare a couple of these clubs that uh, I know how far I can hit. So let's see what this says, here we go. Ball speed 111, carry is 159. That was pretty straightforward there. Total yards was 172. Let's give one more rip with the seven iron. Ball speed was 120, so that was a little bit more. Still looking right. Carry was 160. Okay, so now we're gonna compare it to what my book says and see how the seven iron uh, reacted to the track man and how it does in real life. All right, so I'm nice and warmed up now, and we're gonna go ahead and see what the book says. Guys, I did a video, uh, a what's in the bag video, and I showed you guys how I use this book. And according to my seven iron, I should be hitting roughly 173 yards. Um, so that's a little bit shorter than what the TrackMan simulator is saying. Um, again, this was a outdoor uh, range that I went to and tested this. Um, I played with this book on several courses, and these numbers were super accurate. Um, so let's go ahead and see how close we can get to 173 yards with a seven iron. Let's see what we can do here. Alright, let's put this one on here. This one on deck. Alright, so 173 is what we're looking to get here. Again, we're looking to see how accurate this thing is to 173 yards of carry. Ball speed 122, carry 166. Okay, so it's not terribly off. Uh, a couple things to note, obviously you can't wear uh, golf spikes, um, so that's a factor. Um, also, you're hitting off turf instead of grass, uh, just another factor to consider. <laughs> well, let's see if we can get that 173 number here. Wow. Sales can get it, sir. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
164. So it's staying accurate right around that 166, 165 number. Um, can't really break into the 170s. Let's get these seven iron, three more wax, and we'll switch to another club. That one felt good, had a little bit more ball speed. 165 on the carry. Booked a little right. Still haven't uh, broken into the 170s. Which I feel like I'm striking the ball pretty good. Um, let's see. Chunk that one. We got under it a little bit. Yeah, carry 156. All right, last shot with the uh, seven iron here. Let me switch clubs. I'll show you guys a little bit um, on the softer side as far as how you change the clubs and things like that. Because it's pretty sick. Here we go, seven iron, 173. That was pure. Ball speed 126. Come on, baby. Carry 174, there we go. So that's a little bit more like it. I did feel like I didn't get under the ball at all. I got all ball there, which was really nice. Um, so 174, according to my book. Again, seven iron should go. Da, 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 da. 173, that was 174. I'd say the track man is spot on there, guys. All right, so let me show you guys the software side of things. So we're here on the computer behind the simulator. And what you do is you go up here and you can actually pick a different club. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and go, let's go with a four iron and see how that's like. And uh, let's go from there. So I'm going to set you guys up and uh, swing the four iron. Okay, right, so next up is the four iron. And according to the book, the four iron should go roughly 190 yards. Let's go ahead and put it to the test and see what it can do. Alright, so we're looking for that 190 number here with the 4 iron. Let's see how we could do. Ball speed 129. Carry 182. Okay, so not bad for the first swing with the 4 iron. Let's see if we can get a little bit more out of it and see what happens. We Oh man, chunk that one. I tried getting under it a little bit. Okay. Here we go for him. 190 yards. Let's see what we can do. Nice and tall. Yeah. Feel good. Ball speed 133. Carry 203. But hook big time right. Uh, so the carry was there a little bit more than the, uh, my yardage book says, which is pretty consistent at 190 with the uh, four iron. So seeing that 203 number is good. Let's see what we can do again here. That felt good. Ball speed 130. Carry 197. Okay, so it's taking a little bit higher than what my yardage book says um, I did. One thing to note was the day I um, updated my yardage book, I was outside and it was a little bit on the colder side. Obviously, we're indoors, so it's much warmer. So it's, it's, it's really kind of humorous, the uh, yardage book that you have in your book. So that a little bit. Very 180. Okay. A little bit more straight there. All in all, guys, I'm pretty impressed with this TrackMan technology um, as far as its accuracy compared to real life. It's going to be the last shot here at the 4 iron, and then we'll play a couple holes together. That felt good. Ball speed. 137 carry is 201. Okay. So like I said, the 4 iron going a little bit longer here on the trackman than I think it would in actual real life. Um, pretty accurate as far as 190 with the 4 iron. As you can see, the trackman is consistently at around the 200 number. Let's go ahead and play a couple holes and see how this thing uh, plays 
as far as the actual golf holes. All right, guys, so we're here at Lakewood Country Club on the simulator. Let's see how we do. This is a par four, 283 yards. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use the five wood as uh, my tee off shot. Let's see how we do. All right, cool. But we'll get you some answers. Like I said, we can get the posters because we still want Alright, I'm out. That felt good. You can call me. Actually, you got a nice idea. Hey, now we got a shot. Get going. You alright, man? I can't tell what you're doing about. I'm still looking at 42 boards, so we're going to go with the log wedge. I guess that shot didn't register. Let's see. Oh, a little short. You gotta put a little more on it. Okay, so we're still 19 yards. Three times. Three times? I was looking for the first time. 23 yards from the pin. And let's see if we can jump on. Save this bar. He did. Okay, not a bad shot. Alright, guys, so there it is. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Overall, I'm super impressed with this TrackMan technology. Again, love this new facility that opened up right by my house. We're going to be doing a lot more. Uh, recording here especially with the weather we have here in the beautiful chicagoland area um, but i hope you guys enjoyed that video uh, trackman is on point it is accurate um, i shanked a couple shots and they went completely right um, so that's pretty accurate we had a couple nice drives uh, which were pretty accurate the seven iron was dialed in um, as well as the um, five wood that i used um, so if you guys enjoyed that video please go ahead and smash that thumbs up button if you're new here make sure you guys hit that subscribe button let's get to 20k and beyond thank you guys so much for subscribing and supporting me in these golf videos Hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next one.